Hello everybody, welcome to game 30, is this? Could be. Of the Unflappable High Elves, TV event versus Orcs. Okay. Level 11 coach, but he's 4-1-0, so he's obviously an alt or uh, somebody who knows how to play from tabletop or something. And hasn't got very many skills, so that's good. Got some guard, and that's about all. But he's got a lot of inducements. A lot of inducements. <laughs> yeah, his team's rubbish, isn't it? He has not got he has not got guard and mighty blow. He's got zero guard, zero mighty blow. So that's very encouraging. Well, 15 minutes delay, I've got to do. That's going to kill chat, isn't it? Oh, never mind. That will kill chat interaction, but I will still get my out stream hours done, so that's okay. Varag and a bribe. Luckily, Varag isn't actually a ghoul chew, right? He doesn't have tackle, so he's nowhere near as good as he could be, but he's still annoying. It does look like he's going to be a slow player, doesn't it? Yeah. Just based on how long he's taken to, um, to choose his. It's uh, based on how long he's taken to choose his inducements, which were pretty obvious. He's always going to be. It's always going to be uh, Ripper or Varag, wasn't it? And I quite like Varag here, actually, with the extra movement and stuff. And the strength is strong enough, right? So I think I think Varag's a correct choice. Correct. Correct. Hello. We do need the tackle because he's got two dodges. Interesting. Can you just give us 60 minutes of adverts? I can try, mate. I can try. There we go. There's three minutes for you. That'll cover his setup. <laughs> Glorious. No, I won't give in until I'm victorious and I will defend. I will defend. Glorious. Frosty. <laughs> suffer. Suffer with us, no hands for you. <laughs> Thank you very much, Frosty. <laughs> Incredible. <laughs> oh, dear. Hello, Caution. Uh, it's been a bit of flapping versus the rats, I'll be honest. Fucking rats do my head in. Fucking rats. But, you know, I still still played the best I could. 
I pretty much kept it together. I just being so fucking obsessed with rats that you're about to go on a holiday and you and like you can't even fucking qualify with the team. Uh, you just decide to play more fucking rats. What the fuck? Why the fuck would anyone play that much fucking rats? Jesus fuck. Christ. Fucking rats. <laughs> love it. I love that Elliot hates rats as much as I do. I, I honestly think I hate rats more than Norse because at least rats are good. <laughs> <laughs> like, Norse, I hate why anybody would play them because they're shit. <laughs> but, like, rats are just annoying because they're good, aren't they? It's a bit like zombies and dwarves, and like, you kind of don't like losing to them. Doesn't want to hit with his mighty blow character. Why even bother? Why even bother smashing people with mighty blow? Oh, the fucking movement! To be fair, maybe he shouldn't be out there with that movement. Instant full send. Zero fucks given. Maybe he should have GFI to get the better. At least he doesn't have a uh, wizard. Of the prime. Good thing is if he fails the pickup here he just loses basically. That's nice, isn't it? He's managed to not blitz the guy he could have blocked. Huh. Managed to blitz the guy he could have blocked, so there's not a there's guaranteed not a route through. Not what I would have done. Who can say if it was good or terrible? Il s'est emparé du ballon. Très judicieux de sa part puisqu'il faut le ballon pour marquer des points. C'est une transmission. Le lanceur est à son affaire. Maybe I shouldn't have gone that way because if I I don't need him down there, do I need him? Up here, maybe. Ils attaquent le porteur du ballon, Bob. Je sais, Jim. Je te signale qu'on regarde le même match. Actually, it turns out he's pretty great that he's up there now. Ce joueur va-t-il déposséder le porteur du ballon? C'est ça! Vite, mais bien fait! Tout à fait. 
fait le résultat ici, mais c'est comme ça au Blood Bowl. Oh, sure. I guess I should have moved this guy first, eh? Let's be honest. But I was just, you know, I just saw it and I was like, Oh, two plus two plus to score. I'll just score. But I should have moved this guy. Safe moves first. Probably should have just moved him up and then punched him. Yes, that's exactly what I do, Caution. Because you only stop two blocks. You, you get some blocks, you got some block. Oh, sorry, Robinho. I wonder why you said that. Um, <laughs> hello, laughing. Hello, Robinho. Yeah, so... Probably, well... The first few block. I, I definitely like first few block. Because you're only starting with two block normally, right? And you've got a block to win games. So... I like to go block first for the first couple. For sure. After that, probably dodge is going to be better, honestly, than, than block or wrestle. But it doesn't matter that much. And I like wrestle too. Uh, you know, it gives you more ball slacks and it helps you against dwarves and stuff. So I, later in development, I prefer wrestle over block. But early, and, and I generally prefer wrestle before dodge, just due to um, dwarves. But wrestle, dodge is probably better than wrestle, honestly. Just personal preference, really. But you could easily go all wrestle or all block and, or all dodge first. And it's not going to make a lot of odds at the end of the day. Well, survived the uh, the retribution turn. Hopefully, should be able to get the uh, ball loose now. Man, I hate this guy being move five. Ces joueurs sont tout proches. Le combat paraît inévitable. God, elves just going anywhere and doing anything is really nice. What a play, guys. Won't she play like this anywhere else? Everyone's in con in contact, so I just want to score. As much as I would have liked to get a completion on him and go to 13 and then score him into 16. The fact that just everyone's getting pummeled. Got away with it last turn. But... Yep, lovely fella. Thanks. Smiley face, not a winky one. Whew. Dodge that bullet.
wonderful blockless block to open. Woo! He's got some stellar dice on him, hasn't he? He's a master of the gym pals here. Not quite as good as my turn against the Skaven, though. That was particularly great, wasn't it? Eight blocks. Result was killing my own catcher. <laughs> Ah, the shit ballon. Ooh. Did not expect that. It's a great play here by me, by the way. Um, is to push him to there and then blitz this guy from this angle so I can chain him away because he's got jump up, hasn't he? So I don't want to give him a jump up mighty blow hit. So he can chin. Varag away there. Very good. 10 out of 10, Jim. What a player, guys. Definitely better than everybody in Division 1 of Rebel. <laughs> Not one of them was able to play around Sage's jump up killer. <laughs> Literally not one of them. So there you go. It looked like it looks like uh, Pedro was able to do what it feels like everybody should do versus Chunter, which is completely mangle his team to death when he faces you every turn. <laughs> Amazing. Guard in there, wonderful. Wonderful guard position. Well done, Jim. 10 out of 10. Oh, maybe I could have chained him in. Uh, maybe I still can. Uh, probably not now. Maybe I could have chained him in, right? That would have been really nice. But, uh. I guess there's no, no need for it. I want to go for the ball. Not particularly. Could do. Vas-y, mon gars, morsi l'œil. Les 
compagnon fait la force Bien vu, ça Tout est dans l'intimidation C'était une de mes spécialités quand je jouais encore Just punching things is really good, isn't it? Just punching things. Like, like, okay, there's a blood stepper on the ball here with diamond tackle. So, like, he's probably just going to get banged out, though, isn't he? It's not. It's not that. Not that much disruption. I guess he is out of rerolls. So maybe we can go hard next turn as well. Really try to force something here. Yeah, the good thing is you know you don't expect to break armor nine, do you? So it's not as bad. Le ballon est en sécurité. À l'autre équipe de prouver le contraire. Really nice. <laughs> Glorious sidestepper. Shit. Well, shit. <laughs> he got it in the end. <laughs> yeah, I saw Pedro. Unbelievable. Unbelievable, Jay. That's how I feel it should go every time versus Chunter, but it doesn't, does it? Like, it shouldn't, because obviously Armour 7 isn't that weak. But he certainly favours contact and giving up blocks to try and make something happen, doesn't he? Oh, pal me bodger, never lucky. Hmm. 
Oui. Il That was that, that that was to give us the extra hit. Which does pay off. With a dead black oak. Not bad. There's your AV brick. Oh, well, you're very lucky then, Pedro. Normally, normally, like that's the thing about Chunter's style, isn't it? Is that if you like, you know, he puts you under a lot of pressure to make correct plays, and if you don't, if you fuck a turn, then um, it usually costs you one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, or one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah, so this is better, isn't it? I guess just go for that. I'm going to reroll, so I guess get this scoring threat first. This guy defended. It's just so good everyone having dodge and nobody having tackle, isn't it? It's busted, really. Maybe I should have dodged him out first. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Could have, could have protected more about against Farah coming around afterwards. Two red dice blocks into a one dice ball. So. All right, that sounds like Chumney. Ooh, well down block. So it wasn't like a, it wasn't like a forced clone. I mean, when I, when I said diced at the one, I didn't actually mean diced lemon, but yeah. It would have been nice to have picked it up, wouldn't it? Because then it's pretty safe. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Because he would have had the Varag hit anyway. He's not even hitting. I mean, hitting the ball. Let's go there. Protect the catcher. Didn't even try to stop the uh Let's go. Obviously no pass now. Would have done the pass if there'd been a reroll. He's on 15, so he needs a completion. And he needs two completions. And he needs a touchdown. And he needs a completion. And he needs a completion. He got a cat, so he doesn't need a completion anymore. So yeah, a completion for him, and then a touchdown for him, and then that's good enough, isn't it? Yeah, probably 
Probably is a new player, he just got a great record with the with Orcs. He has played rather like a new player, I would say, but then his team's like completely outclassed, isn't it? With not having any dodge. Like, okay, he could have rolled. He could have rolled better than what he did. But, um. You couldn't really stop us just making dodges. There's not a lot, not a lot of counterplay available to him due to the team disparity. C'est un match crucial, Bob. Qu'est-ce que ça te fait d'assister à un match aussi important? On bat la Quenji. Maybe the play here is to um, go for three completions for that line. Two move busts on the LOS. That was why I didn't want to try it for him, because he's got to fucking catch it, hasn't he? Because at least they've got the catch, so it's easier to farm the completion, because two catchers can just pass to each other. So he assists there, which means he screens here, he screens here, blitzes here, push him away because you can put, really nice. I don't know why I picked it up with him and handed it off. Literally makes no sense. Because now I can't. I was thinking I wanted to hand it off back to him at the end and I just picked it up and handed it off to him. What the hell? That was just a complete brain fart. Absolute complete brain fart. Because I, I was just thinking, you know, I'll pass it to him and he'll hand off. And I just picked it up and handed it off for no reason. Oh my god. That was horrific. Absolutely horrific. No problem. I've already forgiven myself. <laughs> oh. 
on fait la force, comme on dit. Le joueur se rapproche d'un coéquipier. Le soutien suffira-t-il à prendre le dessus? Yeah, the lovely pal. Ce joueur préfère se battre entouré. Don't get the surf. Absolutely diced. Really nice not failing anything. Right, so one more completion on the Garda. And then a completion on the Roger. Which should probably be sure feet. <laughs> and then a touchdown on the uh, on the move up guy. He should have focused on the sideline somehow, shouldn't he? Because that's that's unacceptable for him to have that. This guy dominated like that. Yeah, move five elves is fucking horrific. Yeah, should be, but you just can't, can you? Okay, well, rather than dealing with that, he's just sacrificed him. Oh my god. Okay, he hasn't sacrificed him because I misclicked. Great play by him. Don't worry, I've already forgiven myself. Well, use a reroll just to try and keep him alive. Doesn't really achieve anything dodging out over there. But... God, that was terrible, wasn't it? it stopped me getting the uh, completion as well.
more surf there. Doesn't matter, get a stun anyway. Alright, this was very greedy. <laughs> I'm aware that this was very greedy, but I had to uh <laughs> I had to get the ball to him so he can do his completion, right? I hit to. There's a lot of stuff in the way, so it should be all right. The Roger. It's going to be harder to get the Roger up to get a completion. Yeah, I definitely don't want to sack them. Like, you can't afford to sack him because he's an elf. That's the problem, isn't it? And, like, a Rog elf or a block guard elf, even if they're movement five, you just can't. You can't afford to sack them, you need you need men. You need men on your team. I mean unless you were Nix two thousand TV uh ILs, normally you need <laughs> you need the bodies. Hello, Andy. Yeah, no, you can't. No, you just can't. Right. <laughs> Movement four guard, I'd be tempted to keep. <laughs> I think I'd probably have to sack him if he was edge three or move four, but move five is about the worst thing that you can keep, isn't it? And with guard, probably have to keep. There's an element of that, that's fair. The best player to surf here is Varag, isn't it? But, um... Take some risks because it's funny. Realize better things could have happened there. <laughs> Glorious from a surfing no, I won't give point of view. Until I'm victorious. And but I will defend. I will defend. You do have leveling concerns. The 
glorious sorry I'll, gotta gotta think hard about doing this pass oh diced never lucky Yorkshire Kiwi, thank you very much. Staying fantastic for five glorious months. Oh yeah. Thank you very much. Sack almost instantly. I mean the Roger I could have sacked, but again it depends on the health of the team. It's it's not only the amount of games played, like it's how many loners are on the team, right? I just couldn't afford another loaner. I didn't want another loaner on the team at the time. Maybe not 3 0 coming up. Maybe 2 1 coming up now. No, oh, he's not even trying. I mean, he could have he could have picked it up, dodged out, and passed to this guy, couldn't he? Try for the touchdown this turn. Oh, I was gonna blitz, but it's a GFI, isn't it? Fucking hell, man. The bloody minus movement is an absolute killer. No, I guess he doesn't. He's got to have the interceptions. Oh my god, I've used a reroll like every turn. I only rerolled that pointless dodge because I thought I'm not going to use a reroll every single turn, am I? But uh, I nearly have to. I guess this is better than. Short pass. He's got the catch. So. Good. Really, really trying to level this guy. <laughs> Hopefully, you can pass to him and get them both. That misclick got me uh, got me a bit, didn't it? <laughs> that misclick got me a bit. Right, let's do maximum odds of the touchdown then. Maybe no, it's got to be here. Right? <laughs> Level them both, oh baby. What a lovely chat. 
Because, like, you know, these teams getting shat on, isn't it? Like, it's not as if... Like, obviously, I have played better, I think. But it's not as if, like, I'm winning 3-0 because I played loads better. It's just the team is loads better, isn't it? It's, it's, there's loads of dodge. And he's got no tackle. <laughs> and I haven't rolled pad. So... Didn't have to keep writing well played. <laughs> but there you go. Oh, lovely fella. Sorry I couldn't provide one. Oh. Cheers. GG. What a lovely fella. What a lovely fella. Feel bad that he's playing Blood Bowl, eh? <laughs> <laughs> What a lovely fella, didn't you enjoy? Fouha, plenty of levels. Now the old one into one. Not sure that it re-rolls or not because there's no animation. Like, if they just had an animation of the dice roll rolling, right? If they had an animation of the dice rolling, it would be okay. But the fact that they don't have that animation just always makes me think, did it even re-roll it? Like, it just seems to happen more than one in six times. And obviously I know there's perception bias. I know that's a thing and everything. But also, I also know that Cyanide are absolute dog shit at making video games. <laughs> so, I know it doesn't roll ever. Exactly, J5. But the point is... Because it's not missing that, you don't know if it's missing it, right? If it if it if it showed the animation and it didn't show the real animation, then you'd think, ah, you know, or, or whatever. But like, it's impossible to know if it's bugged or not because it never never shows a roll anyway, right? And I like I wouldn't even consider it being a possibility, but except for cyanide already showing us all how terrible they are over and over and over again. Oh, movement. <laughs> Four guard linemen. <laughs> Four guard linemen is, uh, is something, isn't it? I wish the move guy had got move. He gets sidestepped. Helps some of the one turns and stuff, doesn't it? Plus AV is the new meta, um, but not yet. Not yet. Blood Bowl 3. Blood Bowl 3, um, how these guys will level will be dodge or wrestle and guard. Like, dodge, block, guard. See, like this guy, right? This guy, if this is Blood Bowl 3... He just he just takes plus AV plus AV and becomes armor ten. Well, okay, he probably gets plus move, but still. Yeah, okay, fan fox, good point. But if it was released, these guys after getting like this guy would get guard next. These two guys after getting block, well, they probably they've probably gone block for block or wrestle first, then dodge or dodge first, and then block, and they get blodge and then they get guard. And then they just get plus AV twice. Armor 10. Armor 10 linemen, thank you very much. Armor 10 blodge guarders. Yep. Yep. It's going to be amazing, guys. I'm telling you, I'm telling you that's the meta. Plus AV is the new meta on Blood Bowl 3. Um, right, so they, they're sad about the double one for winnings because obviously could have gone to up 12 players. I guess not really because this guy's missed next. Um, but still, after this match, hopefully you can get the extra catcher because got them both blodged, so they don't need anything now, do they? So there you go, not bad. Um, thanks for watching. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe, and stay fantastic.